What is up, ladies and gents? Welcome back. It is yours truly, Light Liger, the crypto enthusiast. And today, we're going to be looking into this brand new token that is operating on Tron blockchain called FRAG. And FRAG is the second deflating token on Tron as a whole, alongside with Void. And I have to say, after taking a look at their website and their future plans, I'm very bullish on this project. I think the price is currently undervalued. I think there's a lot of potential uh, with this project and it will be seeing why exactly in a minute or two as we go through the project. So let's get started with Frag Token. What is it about and when is the next airdrop? So the airdrop number one has already commenced. The airdrop number two will be done through the dApps, which we're going to be touching in a second. But let's start with like the basic details. Let's crunch the numbers. So first of all, we have 10 million initial supply for frag token which is a pretty large sum compared to some of the other projects in the space and it has a one percent transfer burn uh, the average in the space has been pretty much two percent one percent is rather conservative but it's not also uh, the most conservative because we've seen like 0 0.1 and 0 0.01 so there is an amount which is going through at every transaction, which is very nice, but it's not deflating at super fast speed where people are losing so much on basic mundane transactions. So I would say 1% is pretty much on the soft spot. It's not the most fastest, but it allows the developers have time to create these dApps, which we're going to be talking about in a second. And here we can see already the numbers. So we have burned almost 100k tokens so far in the airdrop 1.6 million frags were distributed in 24th of june sadly didn't miss that <laughs> it seems that i always miss the first airdrops for some reason and wave two is going to be happening uh during with the dApps and wave three will be um it, it seems that 8 million frags will be distributed five waves and 10 percent goes to promo contest and lock for the team so that is a very uh good split some projects take, tend to take a lot more for themselves and obviously for this 10 percent obviously a lot more uh, is going to be going through promotion and listings and stuff like that instead of the team and as we have the wave airdrop. Also, what we want to touch upon is that they have their own decks. So we are able to buy and actually did buy just now uh, 10 frag uh, just to showcase you guys the system. So basically they have inbuilt exchange, which is very easy to do. And well, it's very easy to operate in case uh, the other uh, exchange, which you're going to be looking in the second is offline or you don't like the service. And basically, um, you know, uh, the trading quantity is large affected price, so there's a couple of disclaimers. But basically, it is nice to have an inbuilt ex exchange. This is very normal for a lot of Tron dApps, actually, where they have their own exchanges where you can change it to Tron and etc. And also, you can trade it at Tron Watch Market. It is pretty much sitting around for Tron right now, which is a pretty good. You have to remember that a lot of tokens in Tron tend to be less than one Tron. It's like most of the time. So there's only a couple of tokens that are above like the Beats coin and maybe uh, BT. No, even BTT is below, I believe. It's a pretty good high valuation. It started out and it seems to be climbing up now as more features get up. But let's look into the diamond in the system. So they have what we call a frag box and you can Put your frags into the frag box and you will be getting a dividend of all the gambling that is done on the platform. So they have a simple dice game here, which I'm going to be showing you in a second. And basically, people who lose uh, well, frags in this dice game basically go into this pool, which is paid to the people uh, who are staking. So obviously, people who participate on Airdrop 1 are in big benefit to make a lot more money through dividends. And I'm going to be putting... Um, uh, five to deposit. Let's see how that happens. We have the contract here, accept. Let's see. Let's refresh the tab. And here we go. We have 4.4 wife. And obviously that was probably the 1% or there's probably some minimum burn, which caused me to lose that much. But basically, uh, I don't know what is the withdrawal time, I believe, uh, reset streak, okay, so there's a streaking system which increases that uh, total frags already deposit 1 million, so around 600k are in the market apparently, 
so let's look into the game itself. So let's bet one frag here. Game balance, I'm gonna put five. No, I'm actually gonna put four. Deposit, accept. Okay, so here we go, 1%. So I, I believe the smallest cut is 0 0.10 or something like that. So it's not necessarily 1%. And um, we're gonna be tossing, I'm gonna be butts, toss frag, accept. Let's see what happens. Okay, you win, we win. Payout is 2.03, which is very nice. Chance is 50-50. Just for the heck of it, I'm gonna be putting out like three now. Okay, we're gonna put two. Uh, does it go into the actual balance here? No, their wallet balance, yeah. Toss frag, let's see if we get another one. <laughs> we are really gonna lose it. Uh, yeah, nice. So that is pretty much the game, how it works, and this is how uh, the new dividends are basically created. Uh, you can still enjoy the market and join it, and there are probably gonna be other contests along with frag token. Uh, that you can participate and earn some uh, tokens. I think that there uh, in the page they have stated pretty much that they are working on different types of dApps in the future, which are going to be classic dice is going to be also coming out in future. And it seems like a very solid project, the coding's there. And we're probably going to be seeing a lot more use cases in future with Frag Token. So stay tuned for that. I'm going to leave their links down below uh, with my, you know, ref links. So if you want to try it out, the Frag Token box. And also I'm going to believe the Telegrams, Twitters and Discords because there's probably airdrops happening in those places as well. Thanks for watching. I will see you guys next time on the next video.